What is up YouTube? This is Count Blavin coming at you. How's everybody doing? Great, I hope. Well, Gone Gear come in and uh, I figured I'd do the video for it. So, if you watch my Pocket Dump Wednesday video, uh, I had a small rant. I appreciate everybody's well wishes and and you know prayers and stuff i appreciate that so much because apparently it might have worked uh so i think i'm gonna end up i've talked to the bank today and i think i'm gonna end up only losing about eight hundred dollars that's still a big chunk but you know i'm not in the negative anymore and i got most of my money back and we made a new bank account we put a lot of security on it and so i think everything's gonna be okay it's just an asshole because all of our stuff is direct deposit and we do auto pay on everything so it's just gonna be a, but, a butthole switching everything over but thank you to all y'all and i appreciate it now, if it's the first time to my video and you know, uh, you you don't know anything about Going Gear, so what it is is a, a monthly subscription bag. Uh, it's an EDC oriented uh, products. They have two levels now. They used to just have the this bag, and it's sixty dollars a month. You're guaranteed to get no less than two and no more than five items and it will equal up to sixty dollars most of the time it's way more than that but uh you know you will get your money's worth out of this and and most of the time this is stuff that that's usable uh some stuff it's just like any other subscription uh monthly subscription some months are are home runs and some runs some months are strikeouts so excuse me uh, but anyway they had two levels this is a uh, the sixty dollar bag and then they have a, a hundred ninety nine dollar two hundred dollar uh, premium box which you get a two hundred dollar basically a two hundred dollar premium knife and everything in this bag uh, every month so uh, that one's one that's on my future list i hope <laughs> if i can get everything straight and, uh i'm gonna try to work it out to where you know i can do some upgrades and maybe get a couple other things but yeah it's a good it's a good subscription uh, if you're just getting into this and and you just don't really know what you like but you know you want to do EDC and, and have some knives on you, then I say this is for you because $60 a month, most people can do that. And I, I really enjoy this bag. So let's get into this. This is June of 2022. Going Gear EDC Club. I'm using my Civivi Dogma with uh copper scales to open this cool knife it's a little on the heavy side oh did i cut something well i almost did didn't i the reason why i opened it this way is my address and stuff is on the back hmm okay got a swiss army knife now the thing about gone gear is is uh Hmm. Okay. Uh, they actually, they're one of the only ones that actually put all, uh, what the value of it is on their paper. And the reason being is because, um, that's, if you go to their website, that's what it's for sale for on their website. So the first thing on the list is a Travax Cryptic Armored Summit Wallet. $35 well these wallets are getting pretty uh, common and 
you know I don't like carrying a big heavy or big thick wallet anymore but you know these kind of wallets are getting pretty popular Let's see how's this work what you just slip it out like that maybe I should read it the Travax Armored Summit combines the Summit Minimalist minimalist wallet with the RFID protection power of the armor plate don't let RFID skimming thieves get the scheming thieves well yeah I've screwed them thieves uh, get the upper hand the Armored Summit is sourced and made in the US and comes back with a 65 year heirloom warranty that's pretty cool so let's see instructions with cards removed raw access webbing oh okay so I guess you adjust this slide your cards in there and then put this on this side of the cards and that holds them in and you cinch it down with this okay well I'm gonna give it a shot I've been carrying uh, I've been carrying uh, this one for a while and so what I, I'm gonna do is I'll I'll switch it up and I'll use this tray backs and give it a shot you know why not that's pretty good it's made of metal so it's it's gonna be solid made in the USA right on it right there you know you can't really beat that so that's all right so the next thing on the list is the Victorinox Swiss Army uh, serrated Spartan red $30 this is the pocket knife that started it all 12 tools and a compact EDC package this pocket knife has helped me people all around the world get get the job done wherever your everyday adventures take you the serrated Spartan is ready all right well you know I am not gonna complain about a Victorinox a Swiss Army knife is legit quality um, you know and like it says it says it's thirty dollars I guarantee you can go on their website and the serrated Spartan red will be thirty dollars now just taking it out of the blister pack so it's a 12 in one course like all Swiss Army knives you got your toothpick which is cool you got your tweezers and you know these things really work uh, when I was a kid I had a bunch of these Swiss Army knives my dad would let me have them uh, because you know it was like the MacGyver of knives you know and so those tweezers you can use quite well oh what's that on there some stick them it's got some stick them on it golly focus it's coming off though but then you got your can opener and a small flat tip screwdriver and then you have your bottle opener and wire stripper and a flat tip screwdriver and then you have your big blade which this one is serrated all the way down the original I'm I'm thinking the original was just a a plate plain drop point blade and then you have your small blade uh, 
And these are razor sharp, man. These things. Oh, okay. And then you have your corkscrew. In case you need to open a bottle of wine. Who who don't need to open a bottle of wine? If you got one of these with you, you can always open one. Doesn't matter where you're at. Even driving down the road. Nope, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> I'm just joking. That's a joke. It's a joke, everybody. So, there's the leather punch. And uh, the neat uh, thread eye. So you can, like sew some leather together but yeah these things are really awesome they last forever because they're good quality you know like I said I'll, I'll never complain about a Swiss army knife so let's do the paper test let's do it on the serrated blades let's see what it does look at that That thing is like butter. Oh my gosh. Told y'all. But I think at this point we all know Swiss Army knives are just legit. So let's go ahead and do a paracord test with a serrated blade. Alright, let's do the push through. Always do the push through first. Wow, minimal effort on a serrated blade I can't believe that and then let's do the slice okay got a good slice can we get a pop out of it no I don't think we're gonna be that lucky that's just because it's a serrated blade now let's test the little blade the little plane drop point Look, it's just as, well, that was on me. Yeah, that's just as sharp as the serrated blade. Alright. I'm going to just use these little pieces for a little, for a little blade. Alright, let's do the push through. Okay. Well, because they're small, it was harder for me to push through, but I got them through. And let's do the slice. Alright. Can we get a pop out of a little bit? Nah. But, hey, this is one of them type knives that is awesome to put in... Uh, in your glove box, your console, your purse, your sling bag, your backpack, you know, uh, anything like that. The Victorinox, you know, that's one of them knives you can give to your wife or your girlfriend and you know for a fact that it's going to last her as long as she is willing to pack it or use it. And I've never seen anybody get one of these and complain about it. I'm sure there's some out there. There's a lot of miserable people in the world. And now all they do is live their life to be miserable and to make everybody else around them miserable. I get that. But most normal people. Uh, I've never heard nobody complain about a Victorinox. They're just a legit quality company that's been in... Uh, been in business for a long long time and I usually I usually have this philosophy if it comes in a blister pack it's not worth having really to me it's not uh, because if it's a quality knife you know the manufacturer would make sure you knew it was quality. They wouldn't put it in a darn blister pack. That's, to me, that's saying that's the cheapest of the cheap. But we all know everything in Switzerland is made like a Swiss clock. Uh, I was seeing if they're, say what their metal is. I'm pretty sure it's like 440. So 
So it weighs 2.1 ounces. It's 3.58 inches long. Hmm. Well, so they count the key ring as a usable item of the 12 of the 12 functions don't say what metal it is but I'm pretty sure it's 440 all right well let's get to the last thing in the box lander carrying mini light lantern $25 the car Karen Mini Lantern is a compact 150 lumen LED lantern that packs a punch, both waterproof and drop protected. This makes a great on-the-go light, a 6-inch multi-axis tether for securing your Karen Mini for hands-free use. So, it looks like this. Let's go ahead and break this bad boy out we'll go ahead and use our new Swiss Army knife we got a job for you Swiss Army knife don't we all right Swiss Army knife did its job at ease soldier all right so thought this well okay so you get the charger and some papers this is let's see How many modes? Okay. So I guess that's where you charge it. Weird little speckled pattern on there ain't it so I guess you can even it up and kind of wrap it around and walk around with it like that okay so it's on it's not very bright though. Okay, there's the flash. That's brighter than the flashlight though. Huh. So. Huh. All right. Oh. Okay, so it's pretty bright. So you gotta hold the button to get it to brighten and dim. Huh, yeah. You know, it's always a good thing to have a rechargeable light and that's actually pretty thin 
and could be potentially backpack worthy, sling bag worthy. Yeah, I think that's where it's going to go. That's all right. I mean, they say it's thirty dollars. Hmm. I don't know if Lander's a good company or not, but we're we're gonna give it a shot and see what it does, how it does. Uh, says it got a hundred and fifty lumens at a hundred hour runtime. That's pretty. That's all right for 150 hours. Yeah, that definitely needs to go in your sling bag, your backpack, anything like that. That's that's pretty awesome. Okay, well, you know, see, this is what I'm saying at the beginning of the video or before we started this. This, these things could be. You know, anywhere from a home run to a strikeout. Of course, we all know that it, it's just like that in life. It just is. And I don't know why I use that analogy because I hate baseball. But, uh, you know, everything in this is very usable. You know, you're down to your wallet, uh, your Swiss Army knife, your light. And according to them... These two alone was $65. You go to their website, uh, they'll be $65 together. So there's your bag cost right there. And they say this is $25. Sorry, I, I don't know why I said 30 but uh, this is $25. So, you know, what are we looking at? $90 worth of stuff retail at their store so you know not bad that's not a bad bag for the month what do y'all think and if you do me a favor if you like the video like share subscribe if you think you like this or whatever let me know in the comments below you know every little bit helps and uh, I hope y'all have a good one and as always I, I don't know why I forgot to close with this several times, but I ain't forgot. I hope your belly's full. I hope your refrigerator's full. And for the love of everything, I hope your gas tank's full. And we'll see you next time.